Do you know what the solution, what the humbling thing is? Start investing in someone else and finding out how hard it is. How hard it is to have someone that needs encouragement and exhortation. Do you, do you remember those two keys? Exhorting the saints and to the truth and encouraging them to live the life. That's what discipleship is. It's being with someone where you're exhorting and encouraging them. You're, you're reminding them of the truth and you're telling them how to live it. How do you tell them how to live it? This is how Paul put it. And this is what discipleship is. Paul said, 1 Corinthians 11, 1, be followers together of me like I am of Christ. Follow me like I'm following Christ. That was Paul's simple definition of discipleship. So I ask you, who are you investing in? That's discipleship. Who are you taking to heaven with you? So I have two little props. You know, we just got through Christmas and my family was here and uh, our children, all, everybody, our whole family came back for the holidays and all 15 of us were here and it was such a blessing. And one of my children came up to me and they walked into the studio and they looked and they looked at all the stuff. They saw this, this is my little uh, empty tomb that model from the garden tomb in Israel. And they looked at all these objects I have up here and all my rocks from different places around the world. And they said, Dad, you're always teaching with props. I said, yeah. Actually, that increased 40 years ago when I married Bonnie. Bonnie was a school teacher, and I used to watch her through uh, the door of her classroom as she taught little first graders. And I saw how intently they listened and followed every word, and they were just riveted to her. And I saw her ability to capture their attention using props. So I'm going to capture your attention with some props. Uh, first, let me show you the slide. Um, I have a CD, actually it's a DVD, called Lessons in New Testament Discipleship. It has 22 audio MP3s, and it has 40 video lessons. And that's, that's what it looks like. Now, I'll hold up my prop. Here it is right here. Uh, some of you are not entirely comfortable uh, with an electronic, you know, you can't find Wi-Fi uh, or there's interruptions and, and you like to have your own copy. You want a disc or you want to download a program onto your computer where you aren't dependent on being able to be on the Internet. Well, that's why we developed these courses. And this is a course, Lessons in New Testament Discipleship, that that challenge you, who are you investing in? And I actually give 40, the 40 video classes are me saying, I want you to act like you're sitting across the table at a coffee shop or uh, sitting at Panera or sitting at Starbucks. And these are lessons to show you how to disciple someone, how to say, follow me like I'm following Christ. So that's this prop. This prop is who are you taking with you to heaven? If you have led someone to Christ, then you need to follow up and meet with them and disciple them. So that's my first challenge to you. Lessons in New Testament discipleship. You say, well, where are they? Well, we have 14 right here of these uh, DVDs. And you can see they're, they're here at our uh, main website called discoverthebook.org. We also have one flash drive, uh, 37 ebooks you can download on Kindle, uh, 41 of these, uh, uh, and I'll take you over to see these. Look at these. That is Christ's last words, uh, the audio messages for that entire book. This is the Living Hope book, only these are the audio messages of the book. Here's an entire course on biblical humility where I talk about how we can practice a life that God gets all the glory. Here's another book, Discipline Yourself for Godliness, only these are the audio messages. Here are the videos of the uh, Biblical Humility course. Uh, this is uh, 
another discipleship, following Jesus today. It's, it's not leading others. It's me personally learning to follow Christ today. Here's another one, finding biblical quietness and rest from ultra busy lives. These are DVDs. These are MP3 CDs. Uh, many times you hear me talking about this hungering for God. This series is how to begin a life of praying, fasting, and resting. And then, of course, I have to tell you about my favorites. That's how you even got to me. This is the whole study tour. Uh, DVD one, Galilee declares who Jesus was. DVD two, Jerusalem declares what Jesus did. And Caesarea uh, declares why Jesus came. So all of these are, are resources for those of you that say, well, I love, you know, being online, but I want my own copy. You can just go uh, back to this website, um, dtbm.org. And even some of you love paper copies. And there are seven uh, paper books that you can go to. 